Okay, so people had been posting on Instagram about all these stray domestic rabbits that had been dumped at South LA Wetlands Park. Some said that they had seen up to six bunnies. Now, I had never been here before, but I had been warned not to go during dawn and dusk because it becomes a very sketchy park. So thankfully, I had two volunteers, Megan and Yuri, join me, and this is how it went. Hi, guys. Are you okay with being on camera? Yeah, sure. Okay. Here. Are you okay? Sorry, are you, yeah, yeah, are you fine, good I'm with fine. being on camera? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. What do we have going on? Oh my. Oh my god. Oh wait, it's like right there. That one's like very obviously domestic. Exactly. This is the one that my friends. Well, they're not running away. Yeah, they're not running away, so I think we might be able to catch them, you guys. Oh, they're so cute. I honestly think we'll be able to catch them without needing a lot of stuff. This guy seems the most, like, willing to participate, but, I mean, oh, it's such an open space. I don't think we're going to be able to build trust in it. Len and the bunny to the rescue. <laughs> Now, I know you're probably thinking, oh, why don't you just grab the bunny? This was just me testing the waters to see how social the rabbit actually was. And if you guys watch our channel regularly, then you know that rabbits are very skittish. It was close, yeah. but I don't want to... Where did he go? I don't want to traumatize him. I saw it like uh, two weeks ago, I think, one dead over there. I come almost every day to one here, around here, over here. Uh -huh. So some people that they feed the rabbits and everything, they told me that they, a night cat comes over here and that try to get them. Keep feeding it to gain its trust. Here, um, let me take it really quick. Can we unzip the carrier? expecting that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and throw it in there. Oh my god. Just Oh, we we got to like Can you put it all the way back in there and then close it as fast as possible? Let him get in first. Let him get in first. Oh. Look, this one. Here, come here. Here, here. Close it really fast. Oh my gosh. We did it. Oh we got one. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Yay, high five, Yuri. Good I'm job, baby. Oh my gosh. Okay. This bunny is sick for sure. I can tell something's wrong with its eye. Oh my god. Oh my god. We got a second one, guys. We couldn't film that one, but we have two in this carrier now. Oh. As you can see, these two were the most social out of the group. They came to us, but the remaining bunnies were very difficult to catch. I already knew that I was going to have to go back, possibly a second or a third time. It's going to be really interesting to see, are they neutered, right? Are they neutered? Are they microchipped? One of them has like an eye situation. <gasps> well, you're certainly not neutered, that's for sure. And yes, I see this scratch on your eye. 
So my friend Kat, who volunteers at the shelter, was able to pass these bunnies on to LA Animal Rescue. So I'm going to link all their information in the description below. The following day, I returned again with Yuri. So you're from Japan. Yes, I am. And you have two bunnies. I have two bunnies and I learned everything from your videos. I think I've watched everything, every single of them, like two, three times. Oh my. Like I even took some screenshots. Oh my <laughs> God. Like how to make it bunny proof and all that stuff. Yeah, it's good. Oh. I love it. I'm a huge fan. <laughs> Okay, so you, you're sweet. making me nervous. No, no, no. I I really appreciate that. I'm, I'm so glad that you're able to join us on this rescue mission. Yeah. Unfortunately, we had no luck this day. The rabbits were extremely skittish. And as I mentioned, this was a pretty scary neighborhood. And there was a lot of police activity. I got a text from Yuri about a man with a gun nearby. So we went home, basically. It was not safe to stay at that park. So day three, I recruited my dear friend Vicky from Adopt a Bunny Rabbit Rescue, and she and I have caught many stray bunnies together. But of course, on this day, it was pouring rain and absolutely frigid, which did not help our cause. And of course, it starts raining, you guys. Like, it's raining really hard right now. Hey, you better not eat the bunnies. You hear me? Okay, so after a couple hours, we finally were able to condition the black bunny to view this trap as a source of food. It took several attempts because the bunny did not trust this trap. I don't blame him. But it's funny how with video editing, it all seems so quick and easy. But I'm telling you, you guys, it's like watching paint dry, trying to get a bunny to finally go in the trap. Don't move, though. I feel like he's good. We need to let him, like, get in further. Yes! Oh, my God. Sadly, we weren't able to catch the other two that we saw. I mean, you can see the hiding spaces were very complicated. There, cleaning itself. Oh, he's shaking. Okay, oh, he's so okay. scared. Don't be scared. It's okay. ears look good she doesn't I don't see fleas or mites on her I mean I'm not looking everywhere but she looks pretty good again just like the first two bunnies this one is going to LA animal rescue and I will link all their information in the description below so day four guys this time, a volunteer named James joined us. As you can see, it takes a village and lots of tools. A lot of the attempts really consist of building trust with the bunnies, which can be exhausting. There are times when you just want to give up. Yeah, so yummy. That's yummy. This one has a nose infection, too. Uh -oh. okay. Okay. Oh. No! 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 And you just want to go home sometimes, and you're hungry, and you're frustrated. But you wait, and you wait, and then BAM! It's like, okay, we got one. Let's stay a little longer. And another. Vicky, we got him! <laughs> hey guys, hi. Here, here, so, we can set it up again. so these remaining bunnies are going to adopt a bunny rabbit rescue, which is the rescue Vicky runs. I was able to find a foster, thankfully, to take them in. This is them in their new foster home. And you guys, we're just missing this last little guy with blue eyes. He's so beautiful, but he will not let us catch him. 
He's not even enticed by treats or anything. This is definitely the most difficult of all the bunnies. So there was a total of six and we have rescued five so far. I do have a foster home waiting for him. It's just a matter of catching him, but I'm on it, we're on it, and I just wanted to put this video out to help fundraise so we can get these babies spayed and neutered and the proper medical care as well as get them adopted. And as usual, to demonstrate not to dump your bunnies out in the wild. If anybody is interested in adopting or fostering, I'm going to put all the information down below.